This video of migrant workers and their families in Uttar Pradesh has gone viral. People made to squat as they are sprayed with a disinfectant, which later turned out to be bleach. Thousands of workers are fleeing the big cities and returning to their villages. The mass migration, said to be the biggest since partition, began after India imposed a nationwide lockdown. Critics say Prime Minister Narendra Modi's decision was not properly planned and did not anticipate the exodus of India's poor. Modi is shameless. First, he announces a relief package as if it is a gift out of his own generosity. Secondly, Nirmala Sitaraman says no one will go hungry in India under lockdown. 200 million people were starving before COVID-19. Reports of people being beaten as they are bused to the countryside are widespread. Those who couldn't get a bus have been forced to travel thousands of kilometers on foot, sometimes with their families and often without any food. There is no transportation. I have no food to eat and I have nothing. Many are criticizing how the Indian government has treated the poor while flying in more affluent people who were stranded abroad. To all the rich and entitled Indians, please see and feel the lockdown, the displacement and the economic rut happening on poor 90% of people of this country. It has been brought up in India, those who travel back from infected countries, including religious travel, help them. India has a population of more than 1.3 billion, and 60% of them live on less than $3 a day. The disparity is so stark that the country's richest one person own more than half of India's wealth. As COVID-19 begins to transmit within the community, there's a risk that this health crisis will become a humanitarian one.